Family HealthCast. Hi, everyone. If going to camp is on your child's summer calendar, they may be able to leave their mask at home. And that's welcome news for this parent who asks, My 12-year-old just got the first shot, and we're wondering how camps will be dealing with kids who have and have not been vaccinated. In just the last two and a half weeks, two and a half million children between 12 and 15 have received the first dose of the Pfizer vaccine. Federal health officials say camps where all staff and campers are vaccinated can return to full capacity and drop many COVID restrictions, including masks. The CDC says unvaccinated children can go without masks most of the time when they're outside because the risk is low. But other prevention strategies should maintained, including physical distancing, grouping youngsters in pods that don't mix with one another, encouraging frequent hand washing, avoiding crowded settings and poorly ventilated indoor areas. Individual camps will have the flexibility to determine both how they go about verifying vaccinations status and how they run programs where not everyone is fully vaccinated. Children are considered fully vaccinated two weeks after their second dose. With more adolescents meeting that criteria by summer, it's possible that they can go back to a camp experience that will feel pre-pandemic. Vaccine approval is not expected for younger children until the end of the summer. Stay healthy. I'm Carrie Lazarus.